This time I was just a little bit late, but still had to pay a price for it. Hey everyone, Silver Steeler here. And winning image photography. Malone LaVey, type 9. The two ounce round from Intaglio Mint. And we actually got this one. Yep, we got it late again. We thought we were going to get it on time. We signed up for an alert on limited mintage. And within five minutes of them giving me uh, an email about it, it was already gone. And we couldn't find it anywhere else. No, so again, I had to find it on the secondary market. Did it pay as much this time? I think it's because silver's come down a little bit since the, the last two I had gotten. But I'm so glad this series is getting ready to end because the first six I bought relatively cheap and now the last three, not so cheap. So my cost average has definitely gone down on these, but also got four of the one ounce versions here. Talking bullion, let me know that limited mintage had just a thousand of these to sell. Now I'm not so sure if the mintage overall is a thousand on the one ounce or if that's all they got. I find it hard to believe that they would only do a thousand of those. Me too, especially since they probably did more of the two ounce. So, yeah, let me get one of these out here, since these ones were only in flips. There's still some nice high relief on these. These, of course, are a bunch of Spartans. They're Spartans, aren't they? Well, I, I don't know. They're Greek. So they look like Spartans. I think they are. With other shields in a defensive posture. I've seen that in a few movies where they do that. They all clamber up and put their shields together to form one gigantic shield. Something like that, I guess. I don't know, but I decided to pick up four of them. Why not take a chance on them? I don't have too many. Actually, it's the only one ounce Mon Lave rounds I've got. All the other ones are in the two ounce versions. Every one of these shields has like a different design on it. And some of them are real intricate and it's very pretty. It's a very busy round. It's different than the other ones, though. It is. Of course, again, this is ninth in the series of ten that they plan on releasing for this. So since they've been costing me a lot more of late, I'm sort of glad that this this series is coming to an end here soon. So we're down along the banks of White River again. We've done all these outside. And we'll continue to do, well, the last remaining one whenever it comes out, which more than likely will be winter. And I'll be late again. Yeah. Even though I get an email from Limited Mintage saying, Hey, hey, only a thousand left. You should hurry up. And within five minutes, they're gone. I don't know. It just seems like physical silver has just been that quick. I mean, everyone gobbles them up right away. Well, it's nice that we have our LCS, so we're not totally out. Yeah, but on these, on these new releases, we sort of are. Yes. He's not going to have one of these new right away. Or ever. <laughs> I've never seen one at his place. No. He probably gets them, though. I like the series too much to stop when I did, so even though it's cost me a little bit more, I intend to complete this series. I didn't get this far with stopping now. So, anyway, that's going to bring this one to a close. Remember to like, subscribe. And all those other good things. We'll see you on the next video. <laughs> Bye, everyone.